Hey everyone, my name's Jackie, and today I'm going to teach you how to edit and hide these menus from the left from any sub account that you wish, whether you want to do it globally throughout all of your sub accounts, or you want to just choose one specific sub account that you hide. And it's super easy, you just need a little bit of coding, but I'm going to give that all to you in this video so you don't need any prior coding knowledge or experience, just follow this and you'll be sweet. Now if you don't know who I am already, I'm someone that managed to make over 10k a month within just one year of starting my online business and all thanks is to go high level, which took my agency level to a next level. It's literally what it means. Now if you don't have it already or if you're on the verge of thinking about getting it, use the link down below. I can get you a 30 day extended free trial because I am one of the top affiliates for go high level. And if you use that link, you'll automatically get access to my free SaaS course, which teaches you how to set up your SaaS business in just 24 hours. Yes, you heard that right. So that you can just set up your business and you can use the rest of the free trial to start earning money. Now, let's get into it. So what we're going to do is we're going to use a bit of custom CSS. And the CSS code is here. So if you can see here, sub account location ID, we're going to copy all of this and go into our go high level. Reminder, we're in agency settings right now. So we need to go into settings, go company. Once we're in company, we scroll all the way down until we see this custom CSS. Then we're going to paste it in. Now there's two things that we need to grab. First is the sub account location ID. Now that's very easy. We're going to go into one of our sub accounts. You can access the sub accounts in here. Now in here, you see the URL is location. And then after that, there's a bunch of letters. We're going to copy and then go in here, delete all of this until the dot. You want to make sure you have your dot right there and paste it in. Next, we need the menu ID. Now the menu ID can be a little bit complex, but still it's not too hard. And we want to hide, let's say the mobile app. So we're going to right click and click inspect. Note that I'm using Google Chrome. If you use Safari, this won't work because you can't inspect this code. So make sure you use Google Chrome. Now you can use it on Mac. That's what I'm using right now. So now once we've opened inspect, we're going to click on this little button here and then click on here. So that tells us that this area here, this mobile bud app, okay, this is the area that of this code. And from here, we would have, we want to find something that says ID. So I'm going to drag this out so that we can see it a little bit better. Okay. And let's go through here and we see this ID equals SB location mobile app. That's the exact one that we want. So we're going to, double click this and then we're going to see if we can copy this part all the way from SB location mobile app. Copy that and we're going to go in here and paste it in. Make sure you follow exactly what I do. Don't have extra spaces in this hash. Make sure there's no extra spaces here. Make sure you have a space here for the rest. You're not going to touch it. And then now you're going to press update company. Cool. Now that's updated. We're going to close our code so it's not as annoying. And then we're going to refresh this page. And voila, you can see that the mobile app is gone. But then if I hop out and in, into another one, let's go Sky Social. This is my other business account. You can see that the mobile app is still there. So the mobile app menu only disappeared for the other sub account. Now, if you want to do it globally for all of your sub accounts, all you need to do is delete this part of the code in here. Okay, delete, and we're going to press update company. Now, once we've done that, going back, you can see how this the mobile app in here. If I click refresh, boom, gone. So that's exactly how you do this. And you can do this for any single tab that you wish. Now, I hope this video has helped you. Let me know down in the comments below what else you want to watch in the future. Otherwise, I'll see you guys in the next video. God bless.